guess what, the friends? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make two insanely easy five minute meals that I'm eating that help me go from a size 24 to a four. And I'm gonna be making Southwest chicken wraps and loaded sandwiches with cheesy veggies on the side. Sassy's raising his eyebrows behind the camera. <laughs> I can't do that. <laughs> So I'm gonna be starting with the Southwest chicken wraps. This is what you're gonna need. A chopped salad kit, a Southwest one. I'm using this one from Walmart. Everything pretty much is from Walmart here. Southwest chopped salad kit, Fresh Express. If you can find this exact one. For reference, it's 100 calories for one cup. So just look for something similar. Then we need two large tortillas because I'm gonna be making two wraps, one for me, one for Sassy. Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. I'm using the Dempster's Ancient Grains tortillas. And then we need 200 grams of chicken strips that have been cooked divided. So 100 grams per plate here. And I'm using the Great Value Buffalo Style Chicken Strips. It's 140 calories for 100 grams, so whatever similar you can find. And I learned you do need to weigh it out because on the back it says four pieces for 100 grams, but actually this was 100 grams on the scale. So, you know, just weigh oh. it out. Yeah, you get actually more than I thought. I am making this video, the friends, because like I said, I've gone from a size 24 to a four. I've lost 130 pounds total and kept it off for eight years. What I learned on my journey, I needed three things in order to be successful and stay on track. One, I needed to love my meals and look forward to what I was eating every day. Two, I needed it to be super quick and easy to prep because I don't have time, nor do I wanna spend hours prepping my meals. And three, I needed the ingredients for the meals to be very easy to find at a place like Walmart, and I needed them to be budget friendly. These meals do all of that, and that's why I've been able to enjoy my journey and stay on track for as long as I have. I've heated the chicken for about 30 seconds just to take the chill off in the microwave. You don't have to do that. Um, if you like it cold, go for it. So this kit, it's got a Greek yogurt dressing, which is really cool. It's a jalapeno ranch dressing. There's a blend of cheese and yellow and blue tortilla strips that come in it. Also, it's got green and red cabbage, green leaf lettuce, carrots and green onions. So we're gonna mix this up. It's pronounced jalapeno. Jalapeno. There we are. Just got some, look at that. That's quite beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna get everything out. So looks pretty fresh. <laughs> Look at this. Look what it, this is so cute. Ho ho! Okay. Hey, the corn chips are splinking out of there. It's <gasps> like they actually they give you a whole salad kit. <laughs> Use scissors. Don't do what I do. <laughs> yeah. All right. So we're gonna open all these up. And this is not sponsored. Me and Nicole just eat like this all the time. So. Yeah, we just go we just go where it's budget friendly, where we can find easy to buy ingredients and where we buy stuff that's really quick and easy to prep because both of us have lost the same amount of weight and kept it off for the same amount of time. And quick, easy, tasty meals are what really helps us stay on track. So I'm just mixing this up here and then we'll put this together. If you wanna know exactly what I ate to lose the weight, exact meals and portions, I have weight loss eBooks and a guilt-free cookbook. Links are down below. Use code Nicole to save yourself 10%. And I also got something called Huddled or HTLT subs. I'm sponsored by this company. These are the winter flavors. We've got white chocolate peppermint and hot chocolate. These are seasonal, so go get them right now before they go away. Once they're gone, they're gone. Use code Nicole to save yourself 10%. They also have new Seco Bar Plus flavors. And these are amazing. These, like, the boxes are empty because we ate them all. Like, all of them. Because they're so good. And Nicole likes this one, and that's my favorite. We both like them both, but yeah, this one's my favorite, and this one's Sassy's favorite. So I'm gonna put one and a half cups of salad per wrap. So I'm just got my measuring cup here, and I'm just gonna fill this 
up. So there's one cup. There we go. And then I'm going to put another half cup. Oh, that dressing smells amazing. I know, it really does. That's perfect. One bag, two meals for two cute friends. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now we'll put the chicken. This is another part of me and Nicole's philosophy on how to eat in a calorie deficit and not be starving all the time. You wanna have volume in your food. And as you can see, this is huge volume. A ton of volume, it's gonna keep us full. And um, you also, when you're doing it, like we learned protein with every meal yeah. really helps keep you full. Wow, that looks great. So that is a beautiful wrap. I'll put some for yours, Sassy. I wouldn't guess that this is all from Walmart. Looks nice and fresh. And yeah, I know, you would never guess. It's fresh and it was all budget friendly and they carry this stuff always. So that is really cool. Okay, cute muffins, let's wrap this up. So I'm just gonna fold one end here so that you know, less things fall out. And then I'm just gonna wrap this as tightly as I can. Whoa. Ooh, almost a professional. Uh-oh. Uh <laughs> <laughs> That's why I said almost a professional. Okay, let's have a taste test. Okay, let's do it. Mmm, mm-hmm. That dressing is really good. If it makes you dance, it's good. Mm hmm So again, it makes two wraps. 460 calories, 16 grams of fat, 48.5 grams of carbs, and 33 grams of protein per wrap. Whoa. It's a whole meal in a wrap. It's gonna keep us full for hours, especially with the protein, the whole grain, the volume in the salad, and it's tasty and flavorful. And that's another trick that we use. We make sure our foods have a ton of flavor so that it keeps us full for a long time. So we're gonna eat this, and I'm gonna see you in a second a Rooney for the loaded sandwiches, cutie. All right, cuties, meal number two. We're making loaded sandwiches with cheesy veggies on the side. This is what you're gonna need. Two low-calorie hamburger buns. I'm using the Villaggio Toscana hamburger buns and they're 180 calories a bun for reference. Now, why do you use hamburger buns? Because I found when I check sandwich buns, they're about 200 calories plus, but if I look in the aisle, at hamburger buns, you can get really good size like this for way less calories. And um, I like to choose one around 170, 180 because they're pretty like a nice size. And so you can eat sandwich buns if you look around. And we also use hot dog buns or sausage buns. If you find a low calorie one, you can make it subwise as yeah, well. Yeah, instead of like a traditional sub so, bun. Yeah, because those are usually more cows. So then um, we've got four slices of tomato. I'm making one sandwich for me, one for Sassy, obviously. So I've got two for me, two for Sass, and then two slices of cheese. And I'm using this Cracker Barrel medium light cheese. And um, you know, I just get these slices, but I get the light version and then they're really good, 60 cals a slice, so you still get your cheese on your sandwich. Then I've got four teaspoons of margarine divided into two teaspoons each. I use light margarine, and this is our favorite, Basel Light. And um, a quarter cup of shredded lettuce per sandwich, so half a cup total. We love getting this stuff from Walmart because it's pretty cheap, and it's already shredded and clean, so we literally just measure it out and put it in whatever. Salads, sandwiches, it's great. Me and Nicole have learned in the last couple of years to calculate our time into the cost of things. Yeah, and the longer that we keep the weight off, because obviously, like I said, we've both lost 130 pounds, kept it off for eight years. Um, the longer we keep the weight off, the more simple we realize we like things, like very quick, easy, but it has to be tasty, and it has to be realistic because real, realistic food is what has kept us on this journey the entire time while we stay on track as long as we have. Um, sandwich pickles, two per person. These are the great value, and I think it's like five, yeah, five calories for two slices. So these are the dill and garlic, and then, Eight slices of mortadella is what I'm using, but you can use any. If you don't like mortadella, you don't have to use it. Um, it's gonna be four slices of 
per person of deli slices. I'm Italian, so I love mortadella. I never wanted to give it up, so I choose the light version instead of the regular. So if you want something else, about 100 calories for four slices is about the range that we're looking for. And it's gonna be, like I said, four slices per sandwich. Some mustard, I'm gonna use about a teaspoon per sandwich. And then the microwave just dinged because these are the veggies that we're putting on the side. Sassy and I have been using these on and off for years from Walmart in the freezer section. They're Simply Steamers, Green Giant. I love because they come with a cheese sauce and they're pretty low cal. So it's cut broccoli and cauliflower. And for reference, it's three quarters of a cup for 50 calories. So, you know, any frozen veggie that's microwavable and quick in a cheese sauce. Yeah, I'm, that, yeah. Okay, I'm coming. Okay, so those are still cooking. So I'm going to put the sandwiches together. So let's get our spready knife. And I'm going to put about one teaspoon of margarine on the bottom. And then one teaspoon on the top. And actually... You get quite a bit, so we'll see if we use it all or not. There we go. And you can use salt and pepper to taste if you like. I don't think I'm gonna add it yet. So let's butter Sasseroonie's bunny. Is he the cute baloo? <laughs> I was gonna make a buns joke there, but it's, it's too easy. I was waiting for the buns joke, actually. <laughs> it's too easy. That's sad. I like your bun jokes. The friends can figure out what I was gonna say about buttering buns in the comments. <laughs> Do you think we should put the mustard on the top bun or the bottom bun? I think whatever you like. Both, if you want. Let's put it on the top buns, because I think that'll be cute. We'll mustard up the top buns like that, like so. You would have triggered so many people if you just left it like that. <laughs> <laughs> I should Next time we'll do that. Yeah, next time we'll do that. We'll just leave it. I'll just put a big glomp of mustard. Wait, I think Sassy needs a little more on his. Yeah, I, I'm a little bit more of a mustard person. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and then let's put some mortadella on you have four slices i know You're isn't saving. it isn't it crazy like so i'm just gonna kind of like fold them um around that's professional deli style <laughs> sandwich girl there we go shall we go cheese next yeah. like that and then let's go lettuce let us put the lettuce on. let us be sweet let us have cute sandwiches. Then I believe let's have some cute pics. This is also cool, like, we, um, people ask us how do you portion out kind of like odd things like a sandwich. Well, this is exactly how we do it. Yeah, I always like to divide everything up so that, you know, you get a good amount of serving, but also how you portion it out, you know, whether you're doing portions or calories, which Sassy and I like to do both. So that, I think that is a beautiful sandwich. Oh yeah, that's awesome. We'll go like that, like so. Wow, that's a huge sandwich. I know, it's massive. Do you, for thumbnail action, you want it like this or cut in half, cutie? <laughs> okay, cute muffins. So the veggies took about five to six minutes in the microwave. And it's because I was doing two, they would have probably taken four minutes if I was doing one. Um, the greatest thing about the portion control is we're having a cup per serving and one package is one cup. So it's perfect portion control for both of us. And I love this stuff, like it is so good. So we got the one cup of veggies and the sandwich and I'm gonna do a taste test, but first I'll tell you the calories. So per sandwich with one cup of veggies on the side, 458 calories, 21 grams of fat, 44 grams of carbs and 23 grams of protein. And this is going to be our dinner tonight. And like, this is going to keep us full for a really long time. Like, look at the volume in that. And then the volume with the veggies, like we are living life. That's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I'm going to cut this in half. Do you guys um, like cutting your sandwiches in half? Like I love usually on an angle, but because this had a little cute, line i just did it on the line i like when you cut my sandwich okay i'll do that there Whoa, sassy that looks look great. at wow this is a masterpiece of all miracles right now being sweet take a sweet bite 
Mm. Oh! <laughs> oh my goodness. That's like one of the best sandwiches I ever made. I love sandwiches. I was craving sandwiches. And I love that I get to eat them and keep the weight off. And eating like this has helped me fit in a size four, which is crazy. So let's have this. Don't burn your mouth. Cheese makes veggies taste way better. <laughs> yes. I'm gonna go eat this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Realistic. That's what Sassy and I learned. Our meals have to be realistic, tasty, easy to prep, and that's why we've been able to do this as long as we have. And so, hope you enjoyed this. Hope you get inspired to make simple, quick meals that you love. Don't forget to subscribe if you didn't already, sweetheart. And watch this vid and this vid so that you can be cute and sweet and see all these beautiful things, how we love our life and make everything so sweet and we just love food and just... <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you later. Catch you in the next vid. Peace. Cute Rooney. We gotta go out dancing sometime. I know you wouldn't be embarrassed of my dancing at all. No. I'm real good. I'm real good at it. <laughs> Rhythm. <laughs> yeah. See you guys. Bye. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.